Okay, let's see about these guys. Marauder Ringleader and Hooligan. Oh shit, slap my mic. And a lookout, damn it. Hmm. The lookout were killing the shit out of me by sniping before. What does he have? He's got a big gun. But I got a big gun. Oh, not that one. That one. I'm gonna try and snipe their sniper. Okay, there's the lookout guy. This is probably decent cover. Wait, where'd the lookout go? Oh, shit. How did he not see me? I think he's got the same gun I have. Oh my god, this is not really powerful. Oh, it's ineffective against heavy armor, that's why. Oh god! Okay, so maybe I should shoot him first. Damn it. Oh shit. Damn it! He was shooting through the edges of his head. I think that was good sniping the big guy first. Let's do from behind the rock this time though. Coming for me? Do you magically know where I am? Damn! Man, this is gonna be hard. I think I'm gonna snipe him normal, then slow mo snipe him. Maybe that's enough to put him down. Oh, it's drifting. That's why it's hard to aim. All right. Shit, not that. Ah, uh, the shotgun was better. Uh. Thought he was coming close. Shoot again! Damn it! Your guts look pretty. Ooh. Damn it! Shit, that's the sniper. You ain't gonna hit me. Now while I'm jumping. Fuck. Damn, he's a good shot. Ah! 
Why'd you have nothing? Okay, the sniper was here. Bracelet. Okay. Power armor. Retrofitted heavy power armor. 16 armor. Heavy weapon skill minus to stealth, though. This heavy power armor has been retrofitted to be even more durable and insulating. Plus, it has a nice scarf. <laughs> oh, that's so cool looking. But I want to be stealthy for now. If I have to fight, I'll pull that out now. Oh, it weighs 15, though. Damn. Okay, finish looting and then I'll upgrade or level up or whatever. No perk, but got skill points. All right. Okay, I can pickpocket now. Lock the ability to sell goods to vending machines. 25% more bits in containers. Cool. And more rats. Can I hit that one? Can I hit that one? Oh. I'm gonna get all your hides for money. What the fuck? Yeah, hidden stuff. Mag to zap. What was that? Was this mods? Yeah. Modification electronically charges the chamber round immediately before firing upon impact. The round discharges, electrocuting the target. Ooh. Electro guns now. That's that's cool. Why couldn't I do my little dash jump? There we go. Ha! Oh, nothing in that little one. Anything else around here? I don't want to miss anything. Wait. What the hell was that? Okay, so there is stuff over there. This, like... Oh, I could look at the map to find out which doors I can go through, or... Wait. One, three, there was... There was a door here, so no, those are, like, go inside. So these are interiors. Okay. Wait, why are there enemies on the map now? Where are they? Yeah, it's inside this. Oh, I can go inside that, all right. <clears throat> well, let's not go in it just yet then. Oh, 
nothing up here? Eh, there's junk over here now. Ow! Shears? Think industrial strength scissors. Oh my god. <laughs> Got scissors for a weapon. somebody with scissors 22 damage not that bad really do I instantly die if I run with them no oh is this locked Oh, gotta pick it open. Okay. What the hell was that? Ambidextrine? Nasal stimulant, sniper crit damage, bonus t headshot. Wow. Shooting your snoot. Okay. Only last 15 seconds, so it would be like one slow-mo shot, basically. But that's actually pretty powerful. Oh, I can sleep here. Okay. Gourmet salt tuna. Nightingale step. Set of acoustic absorptive materials and baffled joints to reduce the amount of noise generated by a piece of armor. Nightingale step. Volume of footsteps lower. Footsteps sound radius. Huh. I guess it would just make me more stealthy. But stuff doesn't appear to hear me moving around. Like they just see me. What is that? Ali Ali Toxy Free. Also removes earwax now with activated charcoal. Immunized harmful status effects. Huh? I don't understand what this does. Is this snake oil? Yeah, nothing else in here. I mean, that's not anything. Okay. Enemy sprats. Ah, uh, okay. Oh, the rabid. Getting scissored. Damn, they hit me hard. Not the best choice. It's Spacer's choice. Okay. Vending machine. Cool. Pep pills. Extreme. I'll look at that later. Oh, I can go upstairs too. What the hell was that? Skin tough salve? Dermal congealer, hardened armor rating, 10. Life is rough, you need skin tough. Bypass shunts. Ha! 
hack the door to outside. Oh, more stuff. Damn it. Nothing in that one. Spaceship thinking caplet. Mushroom, which increases intelligence for a short time. Insight, tactical time, dilation, recharge rate. Ooh, put on your thinking cap. I guess if I got to beat a smart um, speech check, there's that. Another rifle. What the hell? Alright, whatever. I'm going to unequip my scissors now. Put the hammer back on. Okay, yeah, the computer. Oh, I actually have to use one of those things. All right. Uh, terminal access. Unlock second story balcony door. I already did that. Personal files. I use for Saltuna life taglines. Melts on your fork, not in your mouth. Less fat with some salt. Less fat with some salt tuna flavor. It's brine time. Now with the satisfying crunch of cartilage. <laughs> You can't spell salt tuna without salt. Note, also can't spell salt tuna with... Can't spell salt tuna with aunts? Potential to market forward families? What? You mean without? Leading scientists say, it's still food. The salt tuna will thank you. Warning may cause auditory hallucinations. <laughs> we'll add more later. Messages to R. Thompson. Hey boss, just wanted to check up on the new Saltuna Light project. I've been brainstorming some new taglines for the product line, and I think some of them will really catch our customers' attention. Dear Lawrence, I appreciate your hard work on behalf of beloved brand of Saltuna. I just realized a response from just received a response from corporate. They're not interested in your idea of a light version of the Saltuna brand because we'd rather not compete with ourselves. But they are interested in the idea of lighter salt tuna. Effective immediately, we will begin instruct we, we have been instructed to use heavier weighted cans so we can pack them with less salt tuna, thereby saving bits to every can. This is exactly the kind of breakthrough our cannery needs. In fact, our logistics department has just confirmed my request to have you transferred from the marketing division to the cannery. Can you imagine, Lawrence? You'll be rubbing elbows with your fellow workers on the canning line, filling each slightly heavier can with slightly less salt tuna hour after hour, day after day. This is a great and tremendous honor for you and for me. Effective immediately, your position in our marketing division has been terminated. I expect you to repay report to our foreman tomorrow morning. Your uniform will be deducted from your pay. <laughs> this is horrible. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, what do vendors have? Space destroys automated sales units. Vending machines offer a variety of items purchased. Hack skill of 20 or higher allows you to sell items to the vending machine. Restricted items on a vendor can only be purchased when you have high enough reputation with the associated faction or a hack skill of 40 or higher. Interesting. What do you, weapons, okay, ammo, I could just buy ammo, cool, two, two per, okay, six or ten per, for, okay, energy stuff is serious, expensive, both level one, level four, fifty-eight, I think that's what mine is, 51 and 58 for these. And 400. I barely have 500 bits. Riot control armor. Uh, I think my armor has four and also stealth skills, so this is kind of worthless. Whether you're a Quelling a civilian riot or just beating down a drug crazed vandal, Armored Ballistics has you covered in their riot control armor. Oh, but a helmet. Better helmet. Club to the head, no problem. You're fine and ready to hit that descending anarchist right back in their surprise face. Oh, this is this is from when I killed that guy earlier. He had this, that's what it was. Stare that exploding bomb right in the face with his ordnance control helmet from Aramid Ballistics. This is a standard issue armored ballistics troop helmet found in fine armies everywhere. Nine armor, intimidate plus three, block plus five, determination five. Hmm. 
intimidate might be cool, but, but blocking one and the stronger armor of it is pretty cool, but so expensive. I might just find one that's better. Uh, fish sticks. Bread noodles. I don't think I want to buy any consumables yet. No mods, though. Increase your ranged weapon skills. This kit stiffens the armor's arm pieces, reducing kickback and sway, increasing range skills. Melee weapon mod, Mr. Ouch. Increases the damage dealt from a power attack. Oh, I love power attacks. Oh, it costs a thousand, though. Jesus Christ. This mod makes a melee weapon have more inertia without increasing its weight. It's best not to think about that. <laughs> uh, okay. 20% power attack damage, though. Wow. Put that on a big weapon. Whisper Quiet Muzzler. Range weapon mod barrel. Reduce the noise of each shot. Bulky attachment that you fitted to the muzzle of any Earth standard caliber weapon. Dramatically reduce the muzzle blast and flash during firing, enabling covert kills. Wish I had more money. I could silence my sniper rifle or the revolver or something. What the crap? Why restricted stock? Oh, okay. Can't buy those yet. Should I sell anything? Hold Z to sell junk. Sold all my junk. <laughs> These like really fancy graves. Man, I don't know why I'm getting hiccups. Let's try stealing from one of these guys. Wait until he turns around. Or maybe I could just hide right behind him. He's, damn it, let me save. Wrong button again. Okay. They were temporarily enemies while I did that. Is he facing this way? But can he see me through her? Seems like they don't know. another assault rifle now because of that. Light assault rifle. Okay, let's let's sort stuff. They're the same? Yeah. Yeah, they're the same. Okay. Alright, let's see if they'll let me steal from him. Oh, he's moving. Oh, he sees what? me. Huh? Hmm. Saw some... Keep your head. So what do you think you're doing? Uh, nothing. 600... No. Whatever I want. Just don't make more paperwork for me, all right?
All right. Okay, that's load. <laughs> You can be both admired and feared by the same faction. They are not mutually exclusive. Interesting. Edgewater discovered. Hmm. Corporate guard. Oops. They start asking you for some medicine. Come tell me. I'll set them straight. Okay. Um... Can I crouch here and pickpocket you? Oh, you saw. What do you think you're doing? Whatever I want, bitch. Just don't make more paperwork for me. Keep your distance, friend. Sick house is no place for a traveler. <coughs> Boss won't let us have any Adrena time. I appreciate the company and all, but you really ought to leave. You don't want to be seen around me. Man, she sounds really sick. Like, the raspiness to her voice. Oh, I don't like that. It makes me want to clear my throat. I go where I want. Hey, keep it down. That kind of talk's bound to put sights on the both of us. I'm in about as much trouble as I can be. <coughs> no reason you ought to be tarnished by association. People are going to talk. Oh my god, clear your throat. <laughs> It's bothering me. <laughs> yeah, who's watching me? The walls talk is all. We all got sights on each other. Any of us breaks company protocol, boss is going to hear about it from six different mouths. Maybe you don't know this, but there's a real simple reason you don't oh, talk to the place. voice. You don't want what we've got. You should get really drunk. Alcohol kills germs. <laughs> <laughs> I I'm not allowed to leave the sick house. Even if I were, I shouldn't be at the cantina. Uh yeah, why not? I don't want to spread what I've got. And I don't want to bring their spirits down. Oh, that's nice. Company always tells us weak spirits lead to weak bodies. If I didn't want to fall sick with plague, maybe I should have worked harder. Maybe I should have taken more pride in my work. Uh, I do have a dream of time, but I think I only got one of them. Hmm. A little late for that. Can't, yeah, you can't blame yourself because you fell sick. I really wish you wouldn't say those sorts of things. I told you once already. People could be listening. I'm just being nice. I'm feeling a touch faint. If you don't mind, I'd like to be alone for a spell. Okay. How many Adrena times do I have? Is it just the one? Yeah, I only have one. I don't know if those are rare. What does it do again? I don't know. It's not that great. Maybe I could give it to her. Can't just exit. God damn. I'll come back. Okay. Ha, nobody saw that. My pet pills. My mag pick. Sleep here and get all infected. Oh, are you dead? Yeah, give me your hat. Will anybody see this? Nope. Nice. Are you dead? I think you're dead. Why you got so much garbage around? What the fuck? That's all right. No prisoners! <laughs> you killing rats? Where the hell did she go? What the crap? Oh. Waste of company ammo! Ooh, ooh, let's save again. Oh, she's distracted. Try and pickpocket her. Ah, oh, goddammit, she's gonna post up on the wall again. Damn it. 
Well, maybe I can steal from this guy back here. he gonna get mad if I take that? <coughs> it's in the garbage. What do you think you're doing? Uh, yeah, whatever I want. Enemies are hostile. Your reputation isn't kill on seat. <laughs> Leaving for a few days will calm things down. People help you have short memories, I think it said. Uh, where was that? Like, whether people hate me or not thing. Reputation, okay. Spacer's choice neutral still? Oh, it only went down 1% for that, okay. Yeah, that's fine. 1% for those 36 bits. I'm fine with this. Yeah, you can keep your salt tuna. Are these people all dead? Pneumatic piston. Okay, what was that? Is that just a junk item? Piston is an integral part of an auto mechanical's moving parts, including limbs, cameras, and weapons. Auto mechanical without a piston, like a canoe without a paddle. Okay. Let me give you it. I'll just do it right now. I don't want any trouble. Here you go. You've got Adrena time? How? No, I don't want to know. Could be you stole it. I did. Could be you're trying to test me. See if I'm going to violate company policy. I'm feeling a touch faint. If you don't mind, I'd like to be alone for a spell. Did she take it? Nope. What the fuck? I'm trying to help you. Can I steal from your foot this time? Okay, your head can't see me. I keep hitting the wrong keys. see me this time stealing from your foot I got a helmet is it better one-handed melee four armor four armor determination uh, what does determination do oh companion health eh. Same armor and a skill I don't really care about. All right. Oh, I didn't take it off her, though. Damn it. What is this? Oh, pasta. Okay. Some garbage back here. Free stuff. Oh, more free stuff. Cool. Is there free shit back here? Sure grip. Ring. A nondescript metal ring. Small metal ring that was most likely des designed for use on a finger, but big-toed customers could find alternative places to wear it. And a sight... 
Anna, your mother passed away from plague. She hasn't chosen to receive medical treatment and failed to receive recover on her own. I found a site near the ocean to bury her. I know it's company policy to have her buried in the graveyard, but I just can't afford the fees. I'm heading out after dark to put her to rest. Say my final goodbyes and all. I know it's dangerous to go out alone at night, but I have to chance it. And if you're reading this, I want you to know that your mother was a good person. Don't blame her for what happened. She worked as hard as she could. I just wasn't hard enough in the end. It just... It just wasn't hard enough in the end. Okay. She didn't... Yeah, she didn't work as hard. Okay. Is that... What is that? What's in his butt? A bottle? He died of bottle butt? Spacer's chaw. I think I had that before. What is that? Yeah. <laughs> General store discovered. Another day at the cannery. Don't go knocking your work. At least we've got work. Okay. I'm gonna try stealing from them. <laughs> Alright, he didn't see that. Will he see this though? Hey, what do you think you're good doing? peripherals? Just don't make any trouble for me, okay? Standard troop helmet, huh? What's that one? Intimidate. Intimidate's probably better in town than stealth skills. Oh yeah, that's the the one I seen in the um, the shop. It's pretty cool looking too. I like it. Let's just say, Conrad, receptionist shot himself. This is bad. Company's going to have to call it in, <coughs> call it for what it is. Destruction of Spacer's Choice property. Eugene was an asset and somebody has to pay his body price. This is going to ruin us, so I was thinking that we pawn off his teeth. Eugene had a full set of gold teeth. Heirlooms passed down his family or something. Uh, you're processing his body, right? Just dig around and pry them out. We sell the teeth somewhere nice and quiet. Just the bits to pay his body price, and nobody's the wiser. What do you think? Don't write back. In fact, don't talk to me at all. Just give me a special signal next time you see me. Waggle your eyebrows. Phyllis G. Merciful law. Is that a marauder's outfit? I don't want you wandering into my shop wearing something you've lifted off a corpse. Please don't touch anything. Your hands are probably crawling with germs. Yeah. Physical hygiene recapitulates moral hygiene. Cleanliness is next to lawfulness. Okay. Hmm. I can show you my hands or... Listening to you makes my head hurt. I do this. This is what happens when you eat with your fingers. <laughs> I'm Conrad. You will report to me if your hair fails to meet Spacer's Choice aesthetic standards. You will also report to me in the event of your death. Whereupon I will clean and prepare your remains for interment. Uh, yeah, prepare my remains for what? Burial. In the unfortunate event of a fatality. It's what a barber does. We make you presentable. Okay. Uh, ask questions first. Go ahead. You seem pretty enthusiastic about this place. Edgewater has been good to me. I consider myself privileged to work here. Ooh. I am never wanting for work. Not since the plague started. What do you know about this plague? The plague's come at us with a vengeance this year. Lost six workers in as many months. I wouldn't call them good workers, mind you. If they were any good, they'd have been treated. Still, it is a shame. Okay. Yeah, why don't you treat them all? Company policy, friend. We don't have enough medicine to treat all of us, so we treat the best among us. Sensible policy. <laughs> no, that's monstrous. Nature is monstrous, friend. And this plague 
is natural selection at work. Hmm, not totally wrong. Edgewater has been good to me. I Sounds exhausting. As the good vicar says, work fortifies the spirit of a man. If you want to feel exhausted, try not having any work. Okay. Yeah, what are symptoms? Fever, chills, fatigue, aching, vomiting, an excess of phlegm, a tendency towards belly aching. <laughs> Sounds a lot like just a flu. Whatever it may be, I have developed my own palliative. Boiled canid liver and a splash Ew. of ethanol. What can I do? Uh, look and repair my ship. Do that first. A ship? Dear me. You seem to have lost the ability to distinguish between reality and fantasy. This is what happens when you let your imagination run wild. I don't approve of fantasizing. It's a dreadful habit, corrosive to the mental faculties. You ought to let the vicar take a look inside your head. Vicar? Vicar Maximilian. Our man from the OSI, here to spread the message of scientism like a soothing balm upon a feverish head. Or so you'd expect. You'll find him in our local church, probably neglecting his duties. <laughs> you don't seem like you like him, yeah. He doesn't seem to like us much. The vicar has not been with us long, and in his relatively short tenure in Edgewater, gives off the distinct whiff of superiority. Like you? Go ahead. Mm. What can I do for you? I need to collect your dues. Oh, wait. Know a thing or two about medicine? Aw. Ah, gravesite fees. Silas and I had talked about this at length. I thought I'd made it clear my pecuniary situation precludes the necessary restitutions. I don't understand a word you said. I mean that I can't possibly pay my gravesite fees. I simply cannot afford it. I am a blemish on the prosperity of our fair settlement. Yeah, when kinda. I expire, I expect Silas to toss my body into a ditch. <laughs> I don't care. Pay up. <laughs> you have a very loose definition of the word prosperity. Quality drama, Conrad. You should audition. Thank you, no. I despise the cereals. Tell Silas I can't afford to pay. And that I fully expect to have my medical rights revoked for this dereliction. With my apologies. Hang on, medical rights? Some time ago, I fell ill with the plague. By the grace of the law, and through my own hard work, I'd proven worthy of treatment. By Frankly, kissing ass, you mean? I don't imagine I'll earn that right a second time. The barber work hasn't been profitable, you see. I've had to keep this old place running with my own savings. Uh, yeah, give him an IOU, I guess. Not a bad idea. But I'd need some kind of collateral. My pair of lucky clippers! No, that won't do. Your idea intrigues me, but I'm afraid I don't have anything to give Silas. I'm open to suggestions. Uh... Oh yeah, the thing I read about the teeth. You know about Eugene? How? I read your thing. Um, dumb shrug. Were you snooping around in my things? Or was it just dumb luck? Eugene's golden teeth were a family heirloom, representing three generations of poor dental hygiene. He took them to his grave. Probably worth a few bits. More than a few. Those teeth were his personal savings. I can't ask Silas to dig up a man's body and pry a few teeth loose from his jaw just to pay my bills. Can I? You can do it yourself. Uh, ain't gonna have to. Yes, I suppose I must. Here you are. Gravesite papers affixed with my signature. And an IOU. Okay. Bye bye. So I can't get a haircut? What can I do for you? 
guess not. Can I sit in a chair and do it or something? Can you can you turn around? Can you move? You don't move at all. All right, well I'm gonna pickpocket you then. Yeah. You suck. All right, what's in here? Oh, just merchant. Could steal from him, but he'd see it, I bet. Broken vending. Ooh, hiccups. Broken vending machine. Okay. Hmm. Not the cash register. Oh, he turns around. Damn it. Make that a little hard to do. Okay. It's not the best choice, it's Spacer's choice. And before you ask, I'm all out of deluxe salt tuna. All I've got is gourmet. Hmm. Go right ahead. I was hoping I could ask about deluxe salt tuna because he said, don't ask about it. Um. Yeah, what's well, your take on the place? What, you mean Edgewater? That's a peculiar question. This is a test. Am I being tested right now? It's oh. uh, fine and dandy. Couldn't be happier. Wouldn't want to spend my life working anywhere else. Prettiest little town on Terra Till. Sure. The blister on my ass is prettier than Edgewater. Do us both a favor and don't try to prove your point. I don't get paid for banter. Was there something you needed? Uh, actually there was. Go right ahead. Anyone I should watch out for? Other than yourself? Definitely the vicar. Don't get me wrong. He seems a decent man, cut from church cloth, knows his scriptures. So I should avoid but him. There's something about him that bothers He's a church man. Like he's not one of us. Sometimes I suspect he doesn't even want to be here. Hmm. Anybody else? I keep a few paces between myself and Miss Holcomb, the town mechanic, since her dear father left the workforce. No mm. ill intent in her, mind. Just a queer sort, restless, scatterbrained, inclined to do first and think after, if you take my meaning. She acts, doesn't think. Amelia. Definitely Amelia Kemp. I advise against stepping foot in her drinking establishment altogether. Word should is, buy my booze here, her right? An auto mechanical barkeep. <laughs> She's, what's the word? Obsolete. You don't want to associate yourself with that kind of person. So about the plague. Plague? I don't know anything about a plague. I just we came through the sick house. Of hot-blooded physical vigor. Yeah, you done being delusional, or should I wait? I take umbrage with your choice of phrase. Ooh, we umbrage. ain't sick. We're rugged. Some of us who get sick are liable to exaggerate the conditions of that sickness. But the fact is, if you work hard, you have got no cause to worry. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Spend enough time in the Spacer's Choice family, and you will come to understand. I'd rather not. Medical treatment is commensurate with our value to society. Spacer's Choice will dispense medicine for the indispensable worker. Natural selection at work. And if you don't work hard enough? Then the hand of medical science will not grace you with its touch. And you must recover on the virtue of your own grit. Listen, you mind if we talk about something else? Rambling about company policy gets me feeling all lightheaded. Okay. More questions. Now. Nothing else? Uh, is um, there more in this? Plague. Yeah, why do you have to hide it? You have got the wrong idea about me. I've got nothing that needs hiding. Some of us who get sick are liable to exaggerate the conditions of that sickness. But the fact is, if you work hard, you have got no cause to worry. What do you mean? Survival of the fittest. It ain't just the law of nature. It's company policy. Medical treatment is commensurate with our value to society. Spacer's choice will dispense medicine for the indispensable worker. Natural selection at work. Seems fair. It is better than fair. It's company policy. Listen, you mind if we talk about something else? Ram yeah, yeah. Ship parts. You ought to go have a talk with the boss, Reed Thompson. He's up in his tower above the cannery. Okay. 
What you got? Music to my ears. Merchant skill is equal to the value of your best dialogue skill and is used to negotiate prices when buying and selling from vendors. Oh. Hmm. All right, I have stolen everything from him. Now let's see if I can sell him his own cigarette lighter. Hey, how's it going there, buddy? Work your jaw on some... Music to my ear. <laughs> I can sell him his own lighter. <laughs> okay. Whoa, his hand's going through there. Okay, stop turning around like that. Don't worry about nothing. It's okay, you can turn around. Hmm? What was that? Hmm? I don't, I don't know. Huh? What happened? Shit's just disappearing. You're imagining things. See shit, buddy. Troop armor, an axe, corporate thingy. Anything else in here? What the hell? Oh, I was hitting that. I'ma take everything. Nothing else. Use that troop armor. Oh, cool. This is that one that uh, I was looking at in the menu there. Dodge 713 armor. Damn, it's almost as powerful as that. Let's put it on for now. Ooh, that is cool. I like that. <laughs>